Ministry 153. When they stepped ashore, they saw a fire of burning coals with a fish on it, and some bread. Yeshua said to them, Bring some of the fish you have just caught. Shimon Kepha went up and dragged the net ashore. It was full of fish, 153 of them. But even with so many, the net wasn't torn. Did you ever wonder why there were 153 fish? Ministry 153 will teach you why in this and other powerful five-minute teachings. The Bible is a Jewish book, the Old Testament and the New. To understand the New Testament, one must understand the 153 fish and feed my lambs. Stay tuned for the next five minutes and truly experience the word from a Hebrew perspective. Ministry 153 is a part of Beth Goyim International Messianic Ministry. Picture this, a little piece of candy. Picture this, a little piece of candy. Picture this, a little piece of candy. Shalom, you're listening to Ministry 153. This is message PO38, number two, a mere trifle. Comes from a, a little saying in Bamidbar 16, verses 8 and 9, that is number 16, 8 and 9, where it says, Is it for you a mere trifle that God, the God of Israel, has separated you from the community of Israel to bring you close to himself? Being in leadership, when we're chosen by God to be his emissaries, to be his light to the world, to bring forth Torah, to bring forth Yeshua the Messiah, is it a mere trifle that somebody would take this job lightly? Is it a mere trifle that we have been separated out to be that close to the king of kings, the royal priesthood? Now, Kepha, Peter, Yeshua's disciple also talks about it in 1 Peter chapter 2, verses 1 through 5, but specifically verse 5. You yourselves as living stones are being built into a spiritual house to be koanim, priests, set apart for God to offer spiritual sacrifices acceptable to him through Yeshua the Messiah. Is it a mere trifle that the Lord has called you out of sin and into the light? Is it that just a little piece of candy or is it something more? And when we don't honor that calling, when we don't honor that blessing, when we don't honor it with every aspect of our life, we make it a mere trifle. That, oh, yes, we've been called to be a, a mere trifle. You know, that we can, we can just do things for the Lord. It, it's just such a, a boring thing to do. No, it should be more than a mere trifle that we have been separated out for such an incredible purpose. We, should, we have been separated out to be the light bringers of good news, the Torah, the commandments. This is what separates us from evil in the world. It isn't, it shouldn't be just a mere trifle. It should be something that we truly think about. So today in this devotional, what I would like you to think of before we close, is your life just a mere trifle or should you be doing more for the King of Kings? Is your salvation just a mere trifle to you? Or should you really try to repack God for what he's given you? Is it a mere trifle? Shalom. This is Messianic Rabbi Andrew Dinnerman. I would personally like to thank you for tuning in to the Remnants Call each and every week. You can listen to the full message on our website, BethGoyim.org. If you have drawn closer to the King of Kings, learned more about him today, we are blessed. If you are blessed by these messages, please consider a donation to our ministry. You can go to our website, bethgoyim.org. That's B-E-T-H-G-O-Y-I-M.org. And click on the donate button. You do not have to have a PayPal account to donate. All you need is a debit card. Once again, thank you very much for listening to The Remnants Call.